What is aspect oriented programming? In a well architected application, you have presentation layer, you have business layer, then you have data access layer. In presentation layer, you have all logic about your presentation. Suppose you are adding balance, creating a transaction, all the UI elements, text boxes, command buttons would be in this layer. Then you have a business layer. In business layer, you have all logic about business, how your amount is being calculated in your balance, how it's being retrieved. Then you have a data access layer. In data access layer, you have all the code related to data access technology so that you can change the data access library for, from one library to another library. So we can see there is a nice separation of concerns, but there are some cross cutting concerns like authentication, authorization, auditing and logging. So these concerns should be handled in all layers vertically and horizontally. So uh, let's take an example. Suppose you are writing some code, one function, you are checking the balance from your account. Another function, you are checking, you are adding balance to your account. In all this function, you have to author, authenticate, authorize, uh, enter logging, do auditing. If you are writing same code again and again, you say you would say, "Oh my God, what I am doing?" So that is what aspect oriented programming. Aspect oriented programming is about taking this cross cutting concerns away from your application, it's globalizing. So let's look into aspect oriented programming definition. Aspect oriented programming is a programming paradigm which increases the modularity of your application by removing cross cutting concerns from your application. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, like it, share it and subscribe to this channel for your regular updates. Also connect with me on LinkedIn and Twitter, especially LinkedIn if you like small summaries of the video. I will be posting a lot of small summaries of the video on LinkedIn. Thanks again.